Reiki Level 1 Chakras Chakra means spinning wheel of energy, or energy center in Sanskrit. Each of these centers is associated with specific organs, endocrines, issues, emotions, colors, and elements. Balancing these centers can have a physical, emotional, and spiritual effect on an individual. It is not only important that each individual chakra be balanced, but that they also be balanced in relationship to each other. The lower three chakras are considered masculine in nature and call us to action. They help to ground us and are usually concerned with the material world. The higher three chakras are feminine in nature and are associated with self-reflection and the spiritual aspects of life. The heart chakra is balanced in masculine and feminine energy and can help to balance other chakras. The root chakra, located at the base of the spine, is associated with the spine, bladder, blood, kidneys, male reproductive organs, and feet. An individual with an overactive root chakra can be bossy, domineering, egoic, greedy, and even violent. An individual with an underactive root chakra can feel unloved, sexually inadequate, frustrated, and fearful. A person with a balanced root chakra is grounded, they feel a sense of belonging, trust, and are independent. The sacral chakra is located just below the navel. It is associated with the lymphatic and circulatory systems, the kidneys, adrenal glands, skin, and female reproductive organs. A person with an overactive sacral chakra craves power. They can be manipulative. While a person with an underactive sacral chakra can be shy, feel guilty, and be concerned with what others think. A person with a balanced sacral chakra is friendly, passionate, fulfilled, feels sexual, and playful. The solar plexus chakra is located under the sternum. It is, no, it is associated with the nervous system, the stomach, the gallbladder, large intestine, liver, and pancreas. A person with an overactive solar plexus chakra can be judgmental, stubborn, overly critical, and bully others. A person with an underactive solar plexus chakra can have low self-esteem, procrastinate, be apathetic, and feel taken advantage of. While a person with a balanced solar plexus chakra has respect for self and others, they're confident, calm, and an effective problem solver. The heart chakra is located in the center of the chest. It is associated with the circulatory and respiratory system. Also associated with the arms, hands, shoulders, ribs, breasts, diaphragm, and thymus gland. A person with an overactive heart chakra can feel a sense of entitlement, jealousy, they can blame others, and give too much. A person with an underactive heart chakra has a fear of rejection. They feel unloved, self-pity, neediness. An individual with a balanced heart chakra is loved, loving, empathetic, and helps to bring these qualities out in others. The throat chakra is located in the base of the throat area. It is associated with the thyroid, larynx, trachea, ears, nose, teeth, mouth, and throat. A person with an overactive throat chakra speaks too much, they bore others, they criticize, and they're stubborn. An individual with an underactive throat chakra can have difficulty expressing their truth. They may be afraid to speak in public and be timid. A person with a balanced throat chakra expresses themselves and their truth effectively and can be creative. The third eye chakra is located in the middle of the forehead. It is associated with the pituitary gland, eyes, nose, ears, and skeletal system. A person with an overactive third eye chakra can be spaced out, 
feel lost, worry often, and be seen as living in a fantasy world. A person with an underactive third eye chakra cannot see the big picture. They're easily influenced and confused about their purpose, as well as doubting themselves. A person with a balanced third eye chakra is intuitive, charismatic, wise, and understands their purpose. The crown chakra is located at the top of the head. It is associated with the brain, nervous system, and pineal gland. A person with an overactive crown chakra can be addicted to spirituality, they can crave attention, feel the need to be popular. A person with an underactive crown chakra can feel misunderstood, unable to have fun, be unaware or deny their spiritual connection, while a person with a balanced crown chakra is connected to source. They are wise and feel joy often. As you can see, an individual with physical imbalances in a specific area may also reflect the imbalanced qualities associated with the connecting chakra. In a Reiki session, you will not only be balancing physical aspects of the recipient's body, but also their energetic centers. By balancing these centers, the physical body will also be addressed. This concludes Reiki Level 1, Chakras.